Hi, and welcome to self-learning series for Control-M workload automation. My name is Zev Gross. I'm the principal TSA for Control-M Distributed Systems. These series of self-learning videos that you're watching are created with one purpose in mind, and that is tasks with Control-M. The title of today's video, Configure Archive Viewpoints. It's great to have with us James, who's James, who will walk us through step-by-step and how to configure archive viewpoints. Hello, I'm James, and, we'll, and I'll walk through how to change the number of points in Control M Enterprise Manager. Archive viewpoints are the previous day's activity viewable in the Control M EM and allow the jobs to be played back through time. Let's take a look at the archive viewpoints and where they are in the Control M EM, and then how to change the number of days we keep the archive viewpoints. In this example, we have four, four days of archive viewpoints from 219 to 222. Let's change the number of days from four to seven. In order to do that, close the Enterprise Manager and open the Control M Configuration Manager. Okay, we need to navigate to the system parameters. This is done by selecting Tools, then System Configuration, and Control M EM System Parameters. On the left panel, select Advanced. This will show all the parameters that can be managed from the Control M Configuration Manager. The Archive Viewpoint parameters are located in the Gateway section. To quickly find the parameters, we can filter based on Gateway and the names of the parameters. There are two parameters that control the number of days the viewpoints are available, Max Old Day and Max Old Total. These two parameters work together to determine the total number of Archive Viewpoints available. The archive viewpoints are managed by the new day process. So let's select max old day and change the value from 4 to 7. And this change will become effective at the next new day. Thank you, James. That was very informative. So in summary, archived viewpoints can be configured to maintain a history either by number of days or by number of versions. I'm glad that you clarified that for us in this short video. Make sure to check back on our website and find out what new videos we have created to help you be successful in your day-to-day -day tasks with Control-M.